A drug, it didn't really work very well for the Ebola outbreak, but it may be showing some promise in COVID-19 patients. Doctors say it's very early information and more testing needs to be done on it, though. As medical reporter Mike Ferris tells us, that promising drug, it's being tested right here on local patients as well. It's causing headlines in the medical world and business world. News that an older drug used during the Ebola outbreak may be helping patients sick with this SARS-2 coronavirus. Stat Reports writes that it got the news from a recorded video chat that a doctor in Chicago had with her colleagues. She was talking about a clinical trial on the IV antiviral medication Remdesivir. The drug works by inhibiting the virus from making copies of itself. Her comments were about patients on remdesivir having rapid recoveries with fever and respiratory problems, and with most patients getting out of the hospital in less than a week. That news caused stock prices of its makers, Gilead Sciences, to jump 8%. But this is only one small preliminary snapshot from one of the clinical trial sites. There are about 160 hospitals around the world in the study. Tulane Medical Center is one of them. We're actively enrolling subjects with moderate and with severe uh, SARS-CoV-2 infection. Tulane's Dr. Deline Fusco is treating patients with remdesivir as part of these clinical trials, and she cannot release any of the medical outcomes that they are seeing. To qualify for these studies, you have to be an inpatient. It's an IV drug, and one of the criteria is that someone must be admitted to the hospital. But Dr. Fusco does want you to know about this and other research going on before you potentially come to the hospital. The more our public knows that clinical trials are available, the more they can go in knowledgeable about them and ask whether they can be considered for them. She says while working on the front lines has been overwhelming for the entire staff, it's getting better. Now she leaves us with this thought. I think we're doing a great job, but it's, you know, it's not time yet to stop our social distancing. Everyone's tired of it. Everyone's starting to go batty, but um, we're doing a great job and keep up the good work. Meg Farris, Eyewitness News. Other hospitals in the area, UMC, the VA, and Oxner, will also have studies with that same drug.